Ladies and gentlemen, we got a very, very special guest. Where Doug at? Coming to the stage. Who that? Right now we have Sweet Tate. So, what? Sweet. I need yeah, an autograph. Look at there. Can I get a picture? Hey, stop. I'm... <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you, baby. How you doing? Morning, what's up, mama? You good? What's up, y'all? I know that's right. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? I mean, when I got the memo earlier today talking about uh, sweetie, I was like, sweetie, sweetie? I mean, like, <laughs> you know, I hate to say this. I say, the one that used to date, Quavo. Well, why you do that to me? Because I, cause I wanted to make sure it was you. That's all I got? No, that ain't all you got, but... You know, because I'm the icy girl. I was Mrs. McDonald's. I had a Mac campaign. I done broke yeah. some records. Yeah. Well, come I'm... on then. Well, tell, tell, us, tell us some more what you done. A lot. So you don't, you don't want to be referred to as... That's... Of course not. So I guess, I guess there's no chance of you spending the block with the next. I don't really spin the block. Huh? Wait. I don't really spin the block. Spin what about you? Spin the block. What's no, that? Hold on, time out. Oh, sure, I'm having a conversation. Oh, we got okay. Club Shay Shay today. Okay, thank right, you. Go ahead, go ahead, so, go ahead, go ahead. So you don't really, but would you consider it? You know, I don't have uh, a record of doing that, so no. So when you done, you done. Up until now, yeah. So up until see, there's a possibility. You say up until now, you ain't met the right one just yet. Well, if I met the right one, I wouldn't have to spin the block. No, but I'm just, that's, there you go. Okay, how about this? The man, he was, he was nice. I don't know what transpired, and you don't have to get into that. But how you going to get up off the gift the man gave you? Why would you get, get rid of the gift? I didn't want to get rid of the gift. You didn't get rid of it? No. <laughs> what, 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 tell us what happened to the gift. I don't know what happened to the gift. Oh, come on. Come on. I don't know. I, I, I really would like to tell you, sweetie. Now that you know what happened. I don't know. Needless to say, I bought myself the big color in Rolls Royce, so it don't even matter. Right. So you ain't got your own? Absolutely. He didn't take. That's an Ocho. That's an Ocho move. He's an Indian. I mean, he takes stuff back. Who? You. Absolutely. No, I don't. I ain't taking nothing back. You have. You did say it. Name one thing I ever took back. You said if you got somebody something, y'all break up. You got to leave what I got on this the, leave the, it on the table. point. I haven't had to take nothing back because ain't nobody left me. No, that's what you, you just said the other night. Everybody left him. Did he not say that? I did. So oh, now, whoa, 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 whoa. You got to listen. You're not listening. Everybody I was with before real, I ain't never bought him nothing. <laughs> I ain't buy nobody nothing. I ain't buy nah, nah. So you I, ain't about no, but you ain't bought nobody no purse, no earrings, no watch, no car. You ain't never bought no girlfriend you had before real. No. For one, I I'm ain't, just asking a simple question. Let me question. talk. No, no, okay. Let me talk. I'm gonna let you talk, but just answer that question. You could no, I ain't okay. buying nobody no watch because time is free. I'm not buying you a purse because I got the money. I got a lot about to come out. Little, I'm just telling you. What you 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 buy, you buying any of this? What you mean? You buying the heat. At no point in time. She know I'm cheap. Hold on just a second, don't you? <laughs> at no point in time. At no point in time in his life, prior to the, the young lady that he's with now, her name is Rail. Sherelle Rosado. We call her Rail. At no point in time did he ever buy a girlfriend anything. I don't know. I mean, how long would you be with a guy if he didn't buy you nothing? I'm talking about like a purse, or a pair of earrings, or a pair of shoes. I mean, I get gifts before I meet them, so I, I don't know that kind Ooh. of lifestyle. See, she, that's the big boys, though. That's the big fish. Yeah. The, big, the, big, the big fish spoil. The big fish spoil way ahead of time. They court without even having to see you. I can't, like, that's, 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 that's a different ball game. He lied. That's a different ball game. Well, how about this here? Check this out. You a 49er super fan, right? Absolutely. Your grandfather was an athlete. Absolutely. Played 11 seasons in the NFL. Uh-huh. So what is your, the likelihood or chances that you will be willing to date an athlete? Date who? An athlete. Oh, I don't know. I've never dated an athlete. Really? Uh-uh. But you ain't known. Uh, you know, I've just been dating other people. I know, but I'm, oh, in the business. So, yeah. 
But I'm saying, would you be open to dating an athlete? Honestly, what's interesting about um, musicians and how they say we, we date kind of like the same people, it's like high school. You're going to date who you're around. I don't really be around athletes like that, so I never had the opportunity. But if you're out on the set, I mean, athletes be on the set. Now it's not like, you know, after let me... You know what? I got a great question for you. Because he a lot. You were cousins with Gabrielle Union. Mm-hmm. So, what would, did y'all, I mean, how, how close? What, what cousin? First cousin, second cousin? Well, it's my dad's cousin, so my dad grew up with her. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's her real cousin, not that fake cousin that you say. Who? ASAP. You say ASAP. ASAP is my cousin. <laughs> I could call ASAP right now. <laughs> she laughing. She laughing. Because she know that's my cousin. No, she don't. Everybody knows no, that. No, don't nobody know you that. You the only one don't know no, that. No, you don't. You we don't. look just alike. I just ain't got no hair. You look like ASAP to you. Yeah, yeah, thank you. It's a little bit. Thank you. Told you. Do you know how much space is in between that? Huh? That's, that's enough? She said on a scale of one. Are, you, are you, you working on a new album? My first album. Your first one? Yeah. You excited? I'm nervous, excited. You need, why you, you need, why are you nervous? I mean, y'all are athletes. It's like getting ready for the big game. Yes. It's my first big game. Ooh, Ooh I like that. I like that. So what I, can we expect from this album? What, 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 what? Well, I'm from the West Coast, so I feel like my goal is to just tell my story as, you know, a girl growing up in the Bay, Sacramento, California, and what I've been through. Sacta. I know that's right, Bay Area. Did you, did, you, uh, did you always want to be an entertainer? Um, well, I wanted to do hair at first. You wanted to do hair first? And then back then, um, what people make it now is nothing compared to what they used to make back then. And right. when, I, when I looked at the, the annual salary back then, I was like, I got to get my money to this. Right. I so like I, I changed my career over. <laughs> so, could, could, like, if somebody, like, if a girlfriend of yours says, hey, sweetie, can you do my hair? Could you do hair now? Oh, I love getting my girls ready. Oh, you do? Do you? Yeah. I do, I do hair. I do, I do my old lady hair and makeup. Oh, yeah, that's I, cute. Yeah, I install little wigs, uh -huh. flat iron, wash set, okay. curl, everything. You be putting the glue Extensions, down? Extensions, huh? You be putting the glue down? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I use Gorilla Glue. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not, I'm not lying. No, I, I use Gorilla. For my kids, I use edge control. Okay. You can't use Gorilla Glue on here. How you? You gonna pull the whole scalp I mean, off. I meant to say edge control. I'm sorry. Okay, yeah. 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 And, baby, tell him I do your hair. Thank you. She say yes, baby. Yeah. I love that. I do makeup too. That. Matter of mm -hmm. fact, you know Arrogant Tay? Uh-huh. I'm Lonzo. Uh-huh. Jonathan. Uh-huh. I put them niggas on. Really? Yes. Now, ladies, you know your man love you if he help you take your braid down. Thank you. That's a real man That's right me. there. Cutting That's... out, you know, in between the strings, not yep. your hair. And then That's I know love. how to do it so I don't cut her hair. I love that. Yeah, that's how good I am. Okay. Yeah, so the I'm more a... you could do, the more you could save. <laughs> Do here, sweetie. I swear. So how long, how long you been in the game? Um, icy girl dropped 2017. So, mm, three, four. Ooh, dang, that was SoundCloud. Dang, it's been a minute. Right. So when you first when you first started, were you nervous to get up on stage and get up in front of people? Were you nervous? Yeah, I was nervous. So what did you do? To, what did you do to calm your nerves to relax yourself? Hennessy. I'm like, ah! take a look. <laughs> hey, you want you want to try some of my cognac? You know I have a cognac. Well, I, I did dry January. I'm taking my first drink tomorrow night. You should actually come. I'm performing at Club Zook. It's around the corner. Wait, can I help? Can I perform too? Oh, yeah. my goodness. With you? Yeah, come on. Yeah. I'm performing with T-Pain tonight in his residency. Okay, then pull I up perform. tomorrow. Oh, I'm finna be famous. <laughs> I'm finna like be famous. Like he ain't already famous. Do you, do you believe what he's saying? Yeah, he like the cool uncle. Yeah, the, <laughs> hey, the, the cool uncle. One of them lying uncles. And then you like the nosy uncle. Woo, nosy! <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 it's okay. I, sweet, actually, I'm, I'm really it's not okay. nosy. I'm really not nosy. I'm hanging with y'all. So you okay. hanging with us? Yeah. I appreciate that. Of course. So, you like the 49ers. So, how, how avid of a, a fan of sports are you? Well, I grew up playing sports. Really? Yeah. What you play? I ran track, 4x1, 100 hurdles. You ran the 4x1? First yeah. leg or anchor? Third leg. Third okay, leg. Third. Okay, third. I had to, like, hug the corner. Oh, you had to hug, yeah. yeah. Right. <laughs> that curve. You can curve. run that curve? Uh-huh. Yeah. So what's ahead is called, what's behind stays behind, huh? Mm-hmm. Okay. You play basketball, soccer? 
I played basketball for one season. I was point guard, but I couldn't run up and down that court. Yeah. <laughs> they was leaving me behind. <laughs> That's a different type of endurance. Right. Mm-hmm. Let me ask you, were you like, because I was thinking if you say, when you said basketball, I was like, you probably girly girl. I mean, you can't play with all the, I mean, your nails no, are I done. No, played, I played powder puff for four years. I was quarterback. You played powder puff? Uh-huh. Quarter, quarter, what? I got a little arm. Yeah, you got a little okay. arm on you? Mm-hmm. What so what what what? How, I mean, I didn't get the nails until like I became like an artist. Oh, okay, mm-hmm. okay. So you were like you like you were like athletically, huh? I'm big time boy. Really? Mm-hmm. I would have I would have I would have never guessed that. Mm-hmm. That's dope. You are you married? Uh uh-uh. uh. Boyfriend? Uh uh-uh. uh. No. Did she tell you she didn't want to talk about that? No, she told you that. Oh, okay. You the cool uncle. I'm the cool <laughs> uncle. You're not supposed yeah, to be the cool uncle. Yeah, I'm, I'm, not, I'm, yeah, I'm, the, I'm the cool yeah. uncle. See, I told you that. That's really him. Not just, I, I have a friend, I have a friend of mine that would be interested because I found out you were coming, but I wanted to make sure everything was okay before I asked you, and I just want to know if friend? it's okay if, if y'all can meet. No, 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 no. Hold on. Wait a minute now. You can't be coming up here trying to get the hook. No, we don't do that. I'm trying to help. She, she said she's single. You want help? I think you, I think I you No, it's good. She said, she said she never dated an athlete. I have someone high caliber, high caliber athlete that would like to meet her. And he told, he told think? me. What, yeah, what, hey, how, what I, hey, hey, hold on. We're going to ask you, we're going to ask the audience, ask the chat. Put it to the vote. We're going to put it to the vote. You mind? Put put, it to let's the put it to the vote. Okay, chat, what you think? Should Sweetie, should Ocho hook Sweetie up with his, ath- with his athlete friend? Yeah, yeah, that's okay, one. Good here, dude, good What dude do you too. think? Clap if you think Ocho should, Sweetie should. Yeah. <laughs> the nightcap, this the match, the matchmaker. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah. It's hey. Listen. It's that boy too. He oh. hey, he from Pompano. <laughs> he from Pompano. <laughs> oh yeah. He big time. You She's might want. So cool. You might want. You might want. Hey. He like that. That's that boy. I don't know who you talk about. Nah, you, can I tell her or no? Nah. Uh, no. No. <laughs> no. She don't want to be in that. No. We cute. I I, I tell her. Yeah. Tell yeah. Later. Yeah. Tell you, later. Yeah. Tell her. Tell her. I want to put on the tell spot. Tell Okay. Okay. But do you like going to sporting events? Absolutely. Oh, I be losing my my voice at the Niner game. Serious? Yeah. Wait, you understand the game of football? I played football. Okay, my, 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 I apologize. I apologize. So, okay. Who's your favorite player? Um, I really like watching Brett Favre's highlight tapes. That would get me going before the game. Okay. Mm-hmm. Basketball, who's your favorite player? Kobe. Kobe. Hey. Yeah. So you are a Lakers fan? Yeah, but you know, like, when you know when you were born into it, like, that was my dad's favorite player. Right. Coming home, he'd be cooking, the game would be on, so, like, because he liked it, loved it, I loved it. Okay. So I wasn't looking at Kobe how like the world looked at Kobe. I'm just looking at Kobe like my dad's favorite player. So it ended up being my favorite player. That's live. That's live. I'm a daddy girl. I'm, I'm, surpri- I'm surprised hearing you talk that you haven't dated an athlete yet because you're probably more of an athlete's dream because you like sports mm-hmm. and you mm-hmm. like football. Yep. He's going to want you to watch football because, you know, do you like basketball? You like going to sporting events, as opposed to saying, "Ah, oh, that's boring. I don't want it. That's all you do." Blah blah blah. So I'm mm-hmm. surprised. No, it's, I come from a big, big sports family. Pop Warner, all that, them type of games. Pulling up to my uncle, my cousin's practices. Right. Yeah. Uh huh. You have brothers and sisters. I have three siblings. Three siblings. You're uh-huh. the oldest. I'm the oldest though. Wow. Mhm. But well, I got a big family: seven uncles, two aunties. Wow. And hella cousins. So, the, so I guess the cookouts were live, huh? Still live. They're still live. Uh-huh. So let me ask you a question. When you go around your cousins, because obviously you're different, you're not the same little girl that they remember, you're not a, a celeb. So what's it like when you go to the cookout? Do you get bombarded? Oh, let's take a picture, cuz? Honestly, I'm not the most interesting person in my family. What? Yeah, my family is full of characters, and I always tell people that. So when people come over, they just like, it's like one big, like, TV show. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yeah, it's fun. Would you do a reality TV show? Um, yeah, if I was an executive producer. Right. Because mm-hmm. you want to be able to control how it's shot. Yeah, the yeah. narrative. Right. Absolutely. Because you ain't going to be throwing no water and all that kind of stuff, like pulling. Mm-mm. Not, not you. Mm-mm. So what would your reality show be? How, how, would it be based on your career? Would it be Sweetie at Home, Sweetie Cooking? What, what, I mean, what type of reality show would you like to present to an audience? I mean, I like Life in the Fab Lane, like Kamora Lee Simmons, you okay, know? Yeah, it's yeah, a blend yeah, yeah, between, like, yeah. so, your social yes. culture, mm-hmm. you getting money, and then me, like, my personal life as well. Right. You know what? I, I would love to see, if you were to do a reality show, reality show, I would like to see how music music works, just the industry in itself. Because all, all I know, and I'm sure most of the people out here that 
are not in the music. We only see the finished product, the right. album. Right. And then we see them people, people on stage. I want to know all the work that goes into the process. From the very before, beginning, yeah, the thought the process, beginning. the pen, the paper, yeah, and yes. then going to the yeah, studio. Yeah, I want to see that. That, that, would be, that would be dope. This album dope. that you have coming out, when is, it, when is it dropping? I'm not sure yet. You're not sure yet. Mm -hmm. So how long have you been working on this album? Five years. <laughs> Five years. It takes yeah. time. It takes time. Per day. Yeah, perfection. Perfection takes time. Would you write time. a verse a day? <laughs> <laughs> I've been, you know, soul searching, artist searching. Right. Uh-huh. So collabs, how many, I mean, how many oh. features, how many collabs are on the album with you? I mean, typically, I like to get the song done and then get the features afterwards. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Go ahead. She <clears throat> said a feature. Collab. Huh? I rap. Oh. Yeah, I rap. You do? Let me hear something. Huh? Let me Prevalence. hear something. You want, um, Go ahead. I'm not the one to play with. They call me Ocho. Bitch, I got an itch. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> That's it for now. Okay, a little freestyle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, something. You can write for me, and ain't nobody gonna know. Okay. Yeah. Baby, I got another job. No, you don't. So, do you have, like how much like what's your what's your take on like Ghost Riders? Are you okay with that, or do you want to like everything? Basically, every verse that's on this album needs to be sweetie. Absolutely. And I feel like when you're an artist, especially when you're a woman, they try to push you in rooms with like a whole bunch of writers. Right. Just because I feel like they doubt a woman who could write. Um, but I write on all my songs. Absolutely. Really? Yeah, because like recording something that's not mine, I feel like I'm acting. And I don't want to feel like I'm acting my art. I need to be in my art. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's interesting. You know, why is it such a huge problem when rappers or artists have ghostwriters? When R&B singers have people that write for them? Why is this such a such an issue when it comes to rappers? Um, well, I mean, when you look at the history of hip hop, when you go back to like the origins of it, everyone was rap was writing their own rap. So I right. think it just goes with like the culture of where it all like started. Like people was writing their own art. So I think it as it transitioned to mainstream and ghostwriters came about, I think that's when people felt like the art was being diluted. Mm. Right. Okay. Understandable. Understandable. Um, this back and forth. Um, and you don't have to comment on it if you don't want to, but there's, Nikki had her song came out, Hiss, and then, uh, excuse me, Meg had her song came out called Hiss. Nikki, I later found out it's Nicki Minaj, so the barbs came for me because, you know, she goes by one name, apparently, and so I didn't know who that was. But anyway, what is it with women uh, a rapping beat? You know what, I always, Wonder why people even ask that. Because when the men have their beef, it's like, okay, it's like a sport. But when the women do it, it's like not seen as a sport. I feel like when there's beef, it's a sport. And right. you're basically like seeing who's the most witty and who's the most clever. Mm. So the beef is good in women, hip, in hip hop for women, I think, mm -hmm. as long as it stays at the pen. With the pen, who, who has the best penmanship and you get it done in the booth. Right. Not a bad thing. But do you think it can go too far? Because I think because we've seen it go too far. I mean, what you're seeing right now is just battle rap, but just singles. Okay. Because mm. if they was battle rapping, then it wouldn't be like beef. They'd be going at each other on stage like this. But now that it's singles, it's brought a bigger audience to it. You believe if somebody have beef, they can never be friends? They can be friends? Can, okay, let's just say you, be, you, you got beef with, a, with another female. Let's just say her name, Cookie. <laughs> and Cookie, you know, come for you. And then you, she didn't send, you didn't send for her, but she came for you. So you got to, you know, you got to come back at her. Could y'all be friends? Honestly, when it comes to like something being sent to me, if my name on, na ain't on it, then it's not directed towards me. Oh, but she's gonna, she gonna, she gonna make sure you know she talk. Even though she don't say sweetie, you um, know it's about you. Yeah, but I feel like if you don't say my name, then you ain't really about it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Can't ship no package without no address. Exactly. <laughs> But no, I, I'm going to send it to the address. I just ain't got a name on it. I like that. That's a good <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, that's, that's a good one. That's a good one. Hmm. But you I ain't going to open the package, huh? Because if it ain't got your name on it, you ain't going to open the package, even if it know it came to, you know, your direct address, and you know it's your address. It ain't no apartment B. It's, uh, I mean, you live in Hollywood Hills or wherever you live. I don't know where you live. I'm, I ain't going to put your business out there. Um, but I'm just saying. Why are you looking at me like that, sweetie? Because you're posing an interesting question. I think, 
I could like, if I ever get put in that situation, I could see how I address it, but I never look at it like that. You just, would you, if, oh, let me, if somebody, let's just say somebody put your name in it, would you just like, man, I ain't got time for that. I got too much going on, I'm it, sweetie. It, it depends on who it is too. Like if some people don't even deserve a response. It depends on the circumstances. Ah. What's the circumstance that'll make you respond? Well, what's said and who said it. Oh, so. really? Interesting. So how about this? You probably should like, probably like date athletes because like you date somebody in the music injury. No, 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 no. I got somebody for already. Oh, that's what I'm saying. I got I'm, somebody I'm, for already. I am. We're good. I'm, We're good. I'm to, but I'm saying in the music industry, you know, you might mess with, have, have talk to somebody, somebody see you talking to somebody that they used to talk to and they feel some type of way and about you mad. because you talking to him. I mean, because he might have broke up with her, but she didn't break up with him. And so now it might be you that broke them up. Ooh. That sounds like a Lifetime movie. You know what? I've been watching your clips. <laughs> Club Shay Shay. I've been watching it for the past couple of, couple of weeks, and now I see why you're good at what you're doing. What I do? What I no, do? No, I'm a fan. I've been watching it. But Thank you. I really just seeing you that. live in motion, I peep game. <laughs> so <laughs> did, you, did you subscribe to Nightcap and Club Shay Shay? Absolutely. Well, thank you very much. We got a, we got a, we got That's a, why we got a million. Yeah, we got a million, million 1,228. I like it. I'm just trying to figure out. I'm, like I said, when they told me that you, was, you could potentially come on, I'm like, are y'all for real or y'all bull jiving? I just want to feature. Why are you smiling? Bull jiving. Yeah. <laughs> Where are you from? I'm from Georgia. Okay. Yeah, I'm like, are y'all, are y'all for real? Because I like called again. I was like, Ash, are you for real now? Nah, come on now, stop playing. She's like, no, I'm serious. She says it's not a definite yet, but uh, uh, her team says she's interested. I was like, okay. She's like, what do you think? I was like, I'm talking about a sweetie, sweetie. She's like, yeah, shit. How many other sweeties you know? I was like, well, there was that one that show that was on that was on Oprah's network. Y'all remember what I'm talking about? Wasn't that, wasn't that sweeties also? Sweetie pies, right? Yeah. So yeah, I'm just going to make. So weedy. So, yes, S-A. so lady. Yeah. No, so no I but like, I, was, I was pulling up. I've been a fan since Sports Center. Really? You, so you, you watch your car? I watch Sports Center. Oh, I was on there too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> let, me yeah. Just, let me try to steal my shine. Yeah, I, I'm just saying, I was on there so today. You, so, you, uh, your, your show is tonight or tomorrow? Tomorrow. Are you coming? Tomorrow. What time? 2 a.m. Man, you got you got to come. Cause remember, she said I could perform with her. Oh, man, you know I can't keep my eyes open at no two. That's why we gonna take a nap. And you can't keep your eyes on past nine thirty. Now, I'm go- <laughs> baby, you want to go to the show tomorrow? We out. There it is. So in the meantime, so what you what you what, what you getting into tonight? You you gonna gamble? You, you, when you come to Vegas, do you gamble? No, mm-mm. Cause I'm a I'm a like poor sport. If I lose that money, I don't know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> <laughs> So when you come to Vegas, you just come to, ha- I mean, do you come to Vegas like to chill or do you come to come to Vegas to like hang out? Um, I mainly been out here just to, to perform and to work. My first time actually partying in Vegas was my first performance. And how was it? It was cool, but it was, I, got, I wanted to experience Vegas as like a, like a normal Yeah, you want to come, yeah. You want to come and just like the, the, the uh, maybe gamble a little bit because you say you don't want to lose your money, but you know, go places to eat and just see see Vegas. No, I want to come and get lit. You want to come get lit? Yeah, but when you outside and you got cameras on you all the time, you feel like you got to be like somewhat reserved. But you're never going to be able to do that again. You understand that, right? Mm-hmm. Are you okay with that? I mean, it come with the territory. Yeah, see, that, I mean, it's I'm really, like... It's really going to be worse when she date when young she date boy. Yeah. Oh, it's, it's a wrap. Yeah. It's, it's over. Yeah. Yeah. See, I, I like. Yeah. Y'all know who he talking about? No. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey, yeah. Hold on, well, let me see the, what the poll say. Hey. Hey, hey, what the poll? I'm looking for the poll. <laughs> what the poll? What the, what the what, poll say? What, what the poll? Ash, what the poll? Uh, uh, okay. Yeah. Well, I want to really thank you. Ocho and I want to thank you. Thank Night you. Cap, thank you. Live audience. See you tomorrow. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Thank, thank you y'all. for coming thank out, you sweetie. That's unbelievable. I really appreciate me. that. Thank you very much, baby. The cool uncle and the nosy uncle, y'all. Yeah, I'm the cool uncle. I'm the storytelling uncle. Woo. Look at that. Come on, you got. Hold on, you just can't walk up and leave it. Damn. <laughs> Come on, let me see you. Let me see you tomorrow. Thank you. Right. Thank you. Bye thank y'all. you. Sweetie, ladies and gentlemen.
We big time. We get we get celebs coming on our yeah, show. Yeah, we famous. Yeah, <laughs> yeah ain't, ain't nobody do it like us, Ocho. Nope, they not, can't do it. Not like that. Not like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.